Some students in Menominee County had a scare start, a scary start to the first day of school when their school bus was rear ended. The driver of the vehicle police say hit the bus was airlifted to the hospital. NBC 26's Shane Gustafson is live at five with more on what happened. Shane. Yeah, Megan, the county sheriff says the Menominee Indian school bus was stopped with its lights flashing when a man drove into the back of the bus, leaving him with what police call significant injuries. Now, it happened this morning on State Highway 55 near Goodman Fields Road. The school superintendent says this isn't the way anybody wants to start a school year, but also says this incident shows the importance of sharing the road with the school bus. No students were injured in the crash, but like we said, the driver of the other vehicle was flown to the hospital. The superintendent says he hopes the incident serves as a reminder for everybody involved to be aware of your surroundings in school zones or near school buses. Schools are busy places and, and you know, and when schools are back in session, you're going to have a lot of congestion. <clears throat> you know, people driving their kids to school, kids walking to school, all these, you know, it would it, be just that to be more alert. The district says it notified parents of the crash and checked in with the students who saw the crash on the bus throughout the day, but the superintendent called those kids resilient tonight. Now, we did speak with the county sheriff not too long ago. They do not have an update as to the other driver's condition. They also wouldn't release information such as his age. Keeping you connected tonight, Shane Gustafson, NBC 26.